end. As the manhunt continues for the UNM hospital shooter, some people are asking how he got a gun into that supposedly secure facility. Good evening. Police are still on the lookout this evening for 21-year-old Cesar Dominguez Garcia. But it's tough going. They say they've had no new tips today about where he might be. News 13's Jeff Todd is live at UNM Hospital with the last police, last latest police saw of Dominguez Garcia, the surveillance footage from inside the building. Yeah, Jess, this was just released to us within the past hour. Now, take a look at this video. It shows workers who are up on the sixth floor in the pediatric unit as they run out. And soon behind them, Dominguez Garcia comes flying around a corner, chased by two of his girlfriend's family members. Dominguez Garcia had just fired off a shot into the ceiling after roughing up his girlfriend while the two were taking their two-month-old baby to the doctor. While cops are still looking to find Dominguez Garcia, they're pretty sure they do have his gun, the small semi automatic gun was found tucked behind a fire extinguisher in the hospital stairwell. Now, Dominguez Garcia does have a lengthy criminal history, and he is a known gang member. Back to you. Okay, Jeff, when Dominguez Garcia is caught, he will only need $6,000 to bond out of jail. Meanwhile, a just released 911 call from yesterday gives you the feeling of panic among people on that sixth floor when they heard the gunshot. Hello, I'm... Um, I'm a medical student at University Hospital. I'm on the sixth floor of the pediatric department, and someone is shooting. Someone has a gun. Okay. <clears throat> have you seen this person? I have not. Okay. I heard the gunshots. 